queen delivered a preemptive blow that made Sussexes unable to stand as they dared to bully Kate. Queen Elizabeth II put the spotlight back on the latest engagement carried out by Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, after it was overshadowed by a piece of major news focused on the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. The royal family, the official Twitter account of the Queen and all senior royals without their own social media handle, shared this morning a tweet published yesterday by Kate and William. The original message from Kensington Palace focused on Kate's first royal visit since the summer break. He Duchess of Cambridge headed yesterday to RAF Bryce Norton in Oxfordshire to hear more from people who took part in Operation Pitting. However, her visit came shortly after US magazine shared the news Meghan and Prince Harry had made it to its most influential list for 2021 and would be on one of the seven front covers celebrating it. But, by retweeting this morning Kensington Palace's post focused on the royal visit to the RAF base, the Queen's Twitter account likely helped shift back the attention of the public to Kate's work. In Oxfordshire, Kate heard from civilians and military personnel who took part in the largest British aid operation of the past seven decades. With Operation Pitting, the UK helped 15,000 civilians, including some 8,000 Afghans, to leave Afghanistan in less than two weeks after the Taliban seized back power in the country. At RAF Bryce Norton, Kate praised the volunteers and service personnel for their outstanding work after hearing their stories. Wing Commander Calvin Bailey, Officer Commanding 70 Squadron, outlined how the Duchess' interest in these young men and women's crucial work will help them cope with the difficult and harrowing operation they carried out. Wing Captain Bailey told Magazine, they want to tell their story. They want to say, this is hard. I did this. This is what I feel proud about. And she gave that to them today. They were just so important. And so for us there's a lot of necessary catharsis. And so for us there's a lot of necessary catharsis. We need to share our stories and we need to get them out. And that's what the media allows us to kind of do, because it means, for them, their parents will see them on the news tonight and hear their stories. It was priceless. Speaking about the bond created between Kate and the personnel at the RAF base during the engagement, he added, you can tell her, you can have a joke with her and there's stuff there that will always be between them. She was having a very personal discussion with them. Some of that would never leave that crowd. Kate is one of the royals who has focused most of her royal work on mental health, on eradicating the stigma surrounding it and on helping people to speak up when struggling. While at the RAF base, Kate couldn't help but mention her beloved children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. According to Loadmaster Sergeant Mark Curtis, the Duchess revealed her three children share an interest with their father Prince William and Uncle Prince Harry. He told magazine, she did mention that her children are very interested in aircraft. While the Duke of Sussex qualified as an Apache helicopter commander in 2013 and served two tours in Afghanistan, the Duke of Cambridge joined the RAF search and rescue as a helicopter pilot before becoming an air ambulance pilot in 2015. During the Who Cares Wins Award on Tuesday evening, William shared he misses flying and it was good fun. While the world is focused on Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, Kate Middleton is busy delicting Queen Elizabeth II and building a stronger bond with the British people. Prince William's wife grabbed headlines on Friday for a visit at the National Portrait Gallery, where she was meeting with photographers who made her hold still book possible. The 39-year-old mother of three opted for a stunning red coat from a pony in London that has seized the imagination of many fans of the royal family. Catherine, Duchess of Cambridge, was the epitome of class and grace at the event that brought more attention to her book that is a bestseller. Brought more at